Okay, um, so the title of today's presentation is Machine Learning Accelerated Conceptual Crash Simulation. Okay, so first of all, let's talk about finite element crash simulations. Um, finite element crash simulation is a virtual recreation of a destructive crash test of a car or a highway guardrail system in order to examine the level of safety of the car and its occupants. Crash simulations are used by automakers during computer-aided engineering, CAE analysis, for crashworthiness in the CAD process of modeling new cars. During a crash simulation, the kinetic energy that a vehicle holds before the impact is transformed into deformation energy, mostly by the plastic deformation or plasticity of the car body and white structure at the end of the impact. Besides automakers, crash simulations have also been widely adopted by aircraft makers, defense on electronics, and even consumer products to validate the crash worthiness of their product designs. Unlike robot simulations on, and simulators, or game engines in computer science world, our simulations are based on, on comprehensive physics and provides engineering accuracy. For example, complex nonlinear physics and equation solvers are used to solve uh, for the complex contact problem during the impact, the buckling behavior, plastic deformations, and failure in the materials. Also, spot worlds as well, and other connectivities uh, between different components and other modeling features uh, are also included in the physical solve. In the automotive industry, for example, our crash simulations are used by BMW to achieve zero prototyping. Zero prototyping means no prototyping vehicles are actually built for testing to validate its crash worthiness performance. Instead, 3D vehicle models and crash simulation results are used directly to validate the crash designs. Simulation results of um, critical importance, such as uh, displacement, uh, so basic maximum intrusion into the occupant space, the velocity, acceleration histories, kinetic energy, um, crash forces are used directly to drive the vehicle design. Showing on the screen are comparisons of simulation results against on real on testings. Not only is there no visible difference on between simulation and test, the physical quantities and histories are matching really well with experiments. On the left is a dummy impact sled test scenario on to evaluate on the accelerations and injuries that's experienced by humans uh, during a side impact. And on the right um, is a side impact of um, the BMW um, vehicle um, to evaluate how the design of the B pillar and surrounding body in white stops the um, drive, driver department of compartments from being extruded. Mm -hmm.